Hello everyone. Here is my November monthly income report. Uh, let's get started. So total earnings for the month of November is about 550 plus dollars. It crossed that 500 dollar mark, which I consider as the first milestone in the long journey of my niche blogging. So long way ahead, but a small milestone to start with. So precisely the total income, online income for the month of November is $553.74. That's all together. So let's explore the details. <clears throat> to start with, this is the content summary. You can see all together uh, there are about 130 plus posts are published. Uh, last month alone you can see in the bottom about uh, 15 new articles were published uh, with the average uh, word count of about a 2000 word so once again basically i am continuously looking at um, new topics to publish new articles for this particular blog and i'm going to continue that for next few months but last month alone there are about 15 new articles being published onto this blog and uh, if you look into the earnings so here is the co contribution of uh, various uh, um, revenue channels uh, which resulted into that 553 dollars again the primary contributor is ejoic you can see here about 432 us dollar 65 cents that's that's basically the overall revenue for the month of november from ads are purely from the display ads it's a 432 uh, dollar 64 65 cents and within this, uh, I normally deduct that $44 which I pay to Ejoic for that premium service. So this is from Ejoic and uh, moving on, the next revenue source is Google AdSense uh, because there is a tiny percentage of traffic that still goes through uh, Google AdSense. So you can see about a $9.73, about $10 roughly, but precisely $9.73 uh, revenue from Google AdSense for the month of November. And the next major contributor is Amazon. Um, so last month it was actually good to see that I had good sales from uh, UK and Canada also, uh, which were almost used to be a single digit in earlier months. But last month, uh, Canada, UK, it was about 19 pounds, which if you convert it is about 25 US dollars and Canada about uh, 11 US dollars. So. 119 US dollars from US alone, then 19 US, um, pounds from Canada and 14 Canadian dollars. Altogether, if we convert into US dollar, that is 155 US dollars 36 cents. So that's the overall revenue from Amazon. Uh, in individually, if you see United States alone, 119 US dollars and then United Kingdom UK about 25 US dollars and Canada about 10.94. This is the complete revenue from Amazon affiliates. So these are the three uh, revenue sources you have just seen. Ejoic about 432.65. Then Google AdSense about 9.73. And third one is Amazon. Altogether all three countries contributing towards uh, 155.36. So adding up every all three channels, all three revenue sources. So you can see here about 553 US dollars 74 cents. Uh, here you can observe, you can notice uh, Ejoic though overall revenue is about 432.65. I deducted 44 because I pay that 44 for their premium services. So um, after that deduction, it is just 388.65 from Ejoic. Uh, and then 9.73 from AdSense and then um, Amazon about 155.36. Adding these three, it is 553.74 US dollars. That's the total revenue for the month of November. I hope uh, it will continue and uh, probably it may start now uh, growing in the coming months. So moving on to the analytics, uh, it is at least November it is looking good. Uh, I almost um, retained the uh, the page views and uh, user count that I used to have about a three four months back. In between there was little um, uh, reduction with respect to page views and all that for the last two three months. Though it was not major, but about five to ten to fifteen percent. But now more or less it is recovered. Now only worry is again the December core update that is 
currently in progress. Uh, we don't know how it is going to impact. Everybody is just uh, still waiting to see how the final results are going to be. Uh, so if there is no impact, it should grow. If there is an impact, we'll have to see. We need to assess what need to be done about it. But at least for the month of November, uh, even traffic is very consistent. And then moving on to the new site that I have been talking about for the last uh, two to three months, um, where I had huge quality issues. Finally, we are able to now push about 100 articles. You can see here about 100 articles being published so far. It's all been rewritten, major, most of them. I'm still not very happy with the quality of these articles, but uh, I didn't have an option. So already articles were written with so bad quality. And so I had to hire one more um, content writer to just try to do the best possible the, um, uh, editing so that they are in a publishable uh, form. So finally, we are okay with this. I would say still an average quality content only, not uh, excellent or very good. So the plan is, uh, now we already pushed 100 articles. There are about 10, 15 are there, which I'm going to push it probably this month or so. And then leave it for three, four months. Um, we will review this site only in the month of again, uh, maybe March or April. Then it will give some kind of a signals which uh, articles are actually uh, showing some kind of a potential. Though quality is average, still if there will, I am sure there will be some article that are going to perform. Then accordingly, considering those signals, we can actually plan for the next set of uh, content creation for this particular um, new site. That's the plan for now. So the next basically the activities for current month that's a december so for main uh, premium main money block for which we already published about uh, nearly how many articles uh, just about 130 plus articles been published already you can see it here so for next three four months we want to push an, another maybe 60 to 70 articles for this particular block there are we already identified about um, uh, 30 more topics or keywords for which we need to get the content written and then uh, the analysis and research will continue basically in next four months the plan is to cross the 200 mark of number of articles on this particular block uh, we see a lot of potential so probably this may itself this individual blog itself may cross about a thousand dollars of monthly uh, income is, is what we are basically expecting so we will continue to basically push more and more content for this particular uh, uh, niche block. And then the second activity that uh, is planned to uh, be taken care, basically uh, the other activity uh, that is scheduled to happen in December is, um, I'm just thinking about launching maybe one more site in 2021, most likely either January or February. So we need to, I need to spend a lot of time on the niche research as well as the keyword analysis and all that. So the majority uh, time in December is going to be dedicated towards that. While I uh, publish more and more content onto the main uh, blog, the rest of entire time I'm going to spend basically analyzing the new uh, niche. There are some two, three niches already been shortlisted, but um, need to do a lot more analysis. So most likely want to launch in the month of January, though I may push about maybe 10, 15 articles only, but um, maybe from the in the new year, from January to March or April, uh, there is a plan to uh, publish about 100 articles into the new niche site that we are going to launch in 2021. So for that, all the necessary groundwork need to uh, need to be done. That's basically the planned activity for the month of December, mainly for, uh, pushing more content to the existing prime primary money earning block and also preparing the groundwork for the new niche that we are planning to uh, planning to launch in the uh, month of January. So those are all the activities uh, planned for the month of December. So that's all for uh, uh, this month. Uh, overall, it is looking positive, um, at least uh, happy that uh, the income has crossed $500 and hopefully this particular algorithm, the core algorithm that is in progress currently may not impact uh, uh, my blog, but we don't know. So far, the uh, signals are not very positive. Uh, you all know that uh, from last three to four days, the 
core algorithm rollout is happening and a lot of bloggers have seen huge fluctuations and I am not uh, any exception. Almost 30% traffic is down in last uh, about um, uh, three, four days. So, but it happens whenever core algorithms uh, get rolled out, uh, all these fluctuations are very common. It takes about a week to 10 days to really see the trend and some of the blocks will get affected. Some of most of the blocks basically will be recovered or restored to their original traffic. I'm hoping that uh, my blog will basically restore uh, the original traffic, but fingers crossed. Uh, so we will get to know about it only after a week. So depending on the final trends uh, due to impact of this particular core algorithm, then only we'll be able to decide the, the due course. So that's all for uh, today. Uh, so if you have any questions about these revenue streams, about the blog and all those things, please uh, ask your questions in the comment section. I will try my best to answer. Thank you. Bye.